food this morning. Well, it's the time of year that those in agriculture have been waiting for. Farms, orchards, vineyards all across northern Michigan getting ready for the harvest. And to celebrate, Chateau Chantel is hosting its annual Harvest Festival. 7-4's Brett Cast is live now at Chateau Chantel on Old Mission Peninsula to give us a preview of what to expect. Good morning, hey, Good morning, Brett. guys. It's the 18th annual Harvest Fest here at Chateau Chantel, and it's a popular event in, t event in town, uh, giving those who may not know much about wine a chance to get their feet wet both figuratively and literally. Production is in full swing at Chateau Chantal in Grand Traverse County and winemakers are ready for the busiest time of the year. We are getting into our busy season right now, so in a week or so we'll really get into harvest. While harvest has already begun, it will really kick into gear next week, and winemaker Brian Hosmer says the recent weather was a big plus. Yeah, the recent warm-up was a big help to us. It caught us up with the heat accumulation and uh, development of color in some of the red varieties and then uh, increasing sugars in the white varieties. But before Hosmer and other employees spend long hours at work, this Saturday will be a time to celebrate. It's the biggest day of the year for us. We expect to see around 10,000 people come through. Director of Marketing Kyle Brownlee is gearing up for the 18th annual Harvest Fest on Saturday, which gives visitors a chance to learn about tasting and making wine and also stomp some grapes the old-fashioned way. It's always a fun one to watch. Uh, you get to see people in there and uh, just kind of stomping around. It's a little bit of an homage to the, um, the way that they used to produce and uh, make wine. Just like this year's projected harvest, Brownlee says the event is much anticipated, giving everyone a behind the scenes look. You get to see uh, kind of unfiltered access to the entire winery, so that includes the cellar, that includes the bed and breakfast. So we just really encourage having people out, and um, it is, it's like a big open house for us, so we really enjoy it. Harvest Festival takes place this Saturday, October 7th from noon until 4. The wine tasting seminar will be at 1 with the grape stomping there at 2 and then distillation seminar at 3. And even though the event only runs from noon until 4, they are still open uh, for their regular business hours for wine tasting. And that is 11 a.m. until 7 p.m. Reporting in Grand Traverse County, Brett Cast, 7 and 4 News. And I happen to know that you're very excited this time of year about the wine harvest, aren't you? Why do you have to you? out me? Well, <laughs> I don't Northern think Michigan. I did. <laughs> If okay. anybody follows <laughs> Megan Morelli on Twitter, Joe's laughing at me. Now, now something you said during this, it's during during that story was that you'd like to participate in, in yeah, one of these stomps at some point. Yeah, the wine squishing grape thing. Yeah, That's fun. you've never done that. No, well, we never. Should. Have you? Uh, not officially, no. What do you mean, not officially? What well, is that supposed like to mean? Well, if I just happen, I, yeah. if I just happen <laughs> to step on some grapes. You That's uh, as close on the as farm and everything? Do you just like <laughs> squish grapes? Yeah, not in a barrel. I've never done that in a barrel. Well, I we just should, randomly step we can on set this produce. up for everybody at the station to do it on your property. I we think. should. We should, like big, we should do a big we should do a big grape. Can stomp. we just do grocery store grapes though? I don't know. <laughs> like, would are you, you gonna grow grapes? Would you drink anything that I step on? Nope. So it really doesn't <laughs> matter what it is, then does it? <laughs> 